So how does the following sound? Central locking with keyless entry, tactile leather on the fully adjustable steering wheel and gear shift, leather seats in the Warrior and Barbarian, electric windows, electric heated door mirrors, aircon, climate control, privacy glass, cruise control, rain and dust sensors, Bluetooth, hands-free phone connection, and a CD player. I think we better get cracking on this, the all-new Series 5 Mitsubishi L200. Now the L200 has been a popular site on British roads for a number of years now and it could be said is responsible for the continuing popularity of the pickup truck over here. Indeed a little bit of digging brings up the fact that Mitsubishi first brought their L200 to these shores way back in 1982 with this original model staying for the next four years before being superseded by the upgraded model and so on and so forth. All of which means that the current L200 is the Series 5 in a range that has been updated and improved regularly over the years. What Mitsubishi have cleverly done though over these years of R&D is to turn the L200 from a work-based pickup into one that can now be used seven days a week whilst not losing anything from its rugged profile and tough workmanlike ability. Over each refresh of the pickup, Mitsubishi have brought about an increasingly higher set of specifications, making sure that each series was plusher and more user-friendly than the preceding model, until what we end up with is this, the Series 5, a vehicle that Mitsubishi hope combines performance, maneuverability, safety, off-road performance and cabin space with a genuine pack horse load lugging capacity. And it's certainly a handsome looking pickup. It's admirably proportioned with up to date styling that certainly strikes a chord with the public at large. Yes, it is physically imposing, but it's not outrageously so in the manner of an American pickup. In fact, the sweeping lines around the rear doors of the cabin look particularly fantastic to me, and that front end and chrome grille. Superb work, Mitsubishi. And what they've done with this Series 5 is to create something with the size that a workmanlike pickup needs to be while still making sure that it looks good enough to turn your head. Don't forget, just sticking a flatbed onto a truck cabin does not make a car a pickup. Look carefully at the attention to detail at the end of the film. Look at how well Mitsubishi have combined the practicality of the pickup with such a stylish and unmistakable cabin and frontal area. Now at the beginning of this short film, we mentioned some of the fantastic specification that you get inside of the cabin and it really is very well stocked indeed. This is a great place to spend time. Attention to detail is excellent, making it a simple task to achieve a comfortable driving position, helped immeasurably by the imposing height that you find yourself looking out from. And that raised driving height also allows you great sight lines and the ability to see much further ahead than in a more conventional mode of transport. But when it's all said and done, the L200's inline four cylinder 16 valve two and a half litre diesel engine with its turbocharger and intercooler puts out a very healthy 178 bhp at three and a half thousand revs a maximum torque of 317 pounds per foot at a lowly two and a half thousand revs now what this equates to out on the road is instant power where you need it most low down in the rev range and as this is to be a working vehicle as well as that elusive family car it needs that level of torque which allows the L200 to achieve a maximum load weight of a mighty 1050 kilograms and a towing capacity of up to 3100 kilograms and all whilst returning up to a claimed 37.7 mpg this L200 Warrior, it does exactly what it says on the tin. Combine that engine with a slick 5-speed automatic gearbox with a sports mode manual shift facility and paddle shift and you have the ability to tailor the drive to the exact conditions you're faced with, whether you're at work or not. And of course, you've also got Mitsubishi's all-wheel drive system, which allows for traction wherever it is needed, especially with the Easy Select system in operation. 
down by the handbrake and it features a heavy duty rear differential lock whilst the L200 Titan Warrior and Barbarian models also allow you to manually switch between two wheels or four at the turn of a dial. Can you tell that I love this pickup? What remains truly impressive about the L200 though is its road based capabilities as despite its considerable size this really is an easy car to get in and drive. It's as usable as everyday transport for you and the family. It's able to go to the shops, drive out into the countryside or take your family out on holiday. And with a simple addition such as the lockable roll top for the flatbed your luggage or shopping will always be safe. This Mitsubishi rides well isolating the driver and passengers from the worst that our roads have to offer, yet allowing the L200 to be hustled around the bends when the mood or conditions dictate. It's never going to handle or go quite like a sports car, but then I don't really want it to. It's lively enough to be interesting and comfortable enough to allow you to travel great distances in a single day. And the price for all of this? starts at £22,253.80 for the single cab and £24,953.80 for the first double cab. This truly is a fantastic vehicle.